Okay, now this is going to be the tutorial for forcing a card. Now you need a deck of cards. I'm going to use the Ace of Spades. I just lost. Okay, there it is. The Ace of Spades. Okay, now for this forcing card trick, tutorial, whatever you want to call it, is you put this on top, not the bottom, on top. Now what you want to do is swing cut. Doesn't really matter how big for this, you swing cut, grab it, make a pinky break and place it down. So it looks like this, with the big fat pinky break. You can make as big as you want as long as the audience doesn't see that, you know, it's like not gapped up like this and they can tell you have a pinky break. So I'll just like square it up, make it look natural and just kind of go like this. You know, like it's completely in there. And then you, after that, the card, Ace of Spades right here. So I you marked your spot with that. So after you've done this, this is one of the forces. After you've done that, you just lift off the deck. You just lift it like that, but with your thumb. So you just lift it and place it back on top as if nothing ever happened. And it's on that. So this is how it looks at full speed. Take it off and show it to you back again. Now, remember, you just swing cut, pinky break, place on top, do like the rifle thingy, and then place back, and there you go. Now, the other one that I did in my other video is that I did, I also did the swing cut. I kind of did a pinky break, but not as much as one. It's just like resting on the skin of my pinky, and I just kind of went like this because if I do a big pinky break, this is just from my point of view, you can do whatever you want. If I do a really big pinky break, you can kind of see it's kind of slipping and they'll already know that that's going to be the card, you know? So I just kind of not do a pink big one, I just do one that rests against the skin of my pinky. Like a tiny one. Very tiny. And I just keep going and going and going until I reach to the bottom of my pinky break. So, there you go. That's the other one that I've done. Um, you can do like a, the Hindu shuffle card for it, so you put this one on bottom. The one that I just did, you also put on top, by the way. Um, you put this one on bottom for this card for us. Now, you want to do a Hindu shuffle. I, I, uh, people find it easier to do it against a table. This is the Hindu shuffle. I can't really do it against the table, and they just go like this. And, like, they just scrape off all the cards until they get to the last one, and they, they just show the card. But, yeah. I find it easier to do it on my hand. Now, this is the Hindu shuffle at full speed. Whoopsie. Here, I'll do that again. Okay, sorry. Now, it's at full speed. Now, and then, like, they scrape off the last card, and they just go like that or something. But you can also go slow. You don't have to go fast at all. That's just how I do it. Now, the Hindu shuffle is by getting, like, the whole deck of cards and, like, you peel off the top like this. You just keep peeling off the top like this. You just peel off the top and place it in your hand. Like, you just kind of go, like, fast. So if you go fast, it just does this, you know? You just kind of use, like, your thumb and your middle finger and you like peel off the top of the deck that's in your right hand and you just like drop it and catch it in your left and then like you just kind of hold on to the ace of spades and you just let all the other ones come and then you just kind of do that and then you show it to them so those are my card forces that's a card force tutorial uh, please post a comment and rate my video and uh, thank you for watching and have a nice day